Yeah, it's a new record here on the Treasure Coast. Deputies seized 20,000 fentanyl pills in this arrest. That's enough pills to kill every person in the city of Stewart. Had it hit the streets. Deputies arrested 42-year-old Fabrizio Andara of Kissimmee Tuesday. They stopped him for speeding along the turnpike in Palm City and ended up finding about 20,000 fentanyl pills in his car, wrapped like birthday presents in the back of his truck. Andara told investigators that a man in Venezuela told him to go to Orlando for a meeting where he was given the drugs and told him to bring them to someone in Miami. The 20,000 pills doubled the department's previous record of 10,000 pills seized in December. We thought, oh, we're never going to see that much again. You know, it was a one-off. Now we have double that just a few months later. We prevented uh, thousands of deaths. While the major drug stop saved many lives, Sheriff Snyder isn't celebrating. It's a clear indication that uh, we're not winning this war. If, 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 if people out there think that us getting our hands on 20,000 pills in some way made a big difference. It didn't. There's thousands of these uh, uh, doses out there on our streets. And Sergeant Christian Crandall says this drug bust could have easily been missed, but luckily he had K9 Nitro on the scene. There's a lot of stuff in the back of that bed to, to go through, and if he had not alerted, you know, the average uh, deputy would have would have probably let, let the gentleman go on his way. Andara is charged with trafficking of fentanyl and is being held in the Martin County Jail. Andara's connection to the man in Venezuela and whoever was set to receive the shipment in Miami are under investigation. In Stuart Doan Huberman, CBS 12.